So there was a chance that we weren't gonna get it. And I was like, no, I was so excited for this. Okay, y'all, it's a new day. Oh my, <gasps> this is the best thing ever. What? Okay, y'all, it's a new day. It's a new unboxing and today is such a good one guys because we have some chanel but we don't even only have some chanel we have some epic chanel that i am dying over i'm pretty sure i got the last one in the actual world let's open it up okay so a bit of a story time with this one i got this from the best chanel essay in the actual world i will tag her here her name is monica and she is based in the chanel boutique in hawaii i shop from her all the time love her but this item i did not get on her list for i actually didn't even know it was coming out it was crazy which i don't know how because this is so me it's not even funny but someone else did and i'm sure you guys can guess it was none other than my best friend and the legend of Chanel Curator Lab. So Curator Lab got on her list early enough to still have one in stock, right? But they hadn't come in yet, of course, because as it goes, if you get on a list for something that's coming in like next season, of course, you don't know when it's actually coming. Oh, let's just make sure that the other address is under here. There we go. So when I heard about these, of course, I tried to get on anyone's list and I contacted Monica. I was like, oh my gosh, do you have any more room on the list? And she's like, oh my gosh, it's full. I'm so sorry. I didn't know you love these and I was like I do uh, I was like desperate right so Lauren being the legend she is curator lab was like it's okay you can have mine like how epic is that like what are good friends for like honestly because she knew that I would just literally wear these every single day of my actual life so I got Lauren's but then drama happened right because we were like I don't know fourth or fifth or something on the list for the boutique and all of a sudden they weren't gonna get any more they weren't sure if they were gonna get any more because they weren't getting as many as they thought they were going to get because you know Chanel right now is kind of a mess I'm not sure what's happening with production but you know things are like all kind of all over the place okay I know this is a long story time but it'll make sense so there was a chance that we weren't gonna get it and I was like no I was so excited for this so four weeks late a miracle happened and she got one more and I was next on the list well Lauren was next on the list and therefore she gave it to me she is an actual legend all of the credit of this goes to Curator Lab. Guys, if you are not following her already, let me just give you like a rundown of what Lauren does really quick. So she is a personal shopper and a Chanel expert. So she'll just post everything that she's buying of Chanel and Hermes and like she has just really fun unboxings. But also if you're ever curious and you want to get something that you can't find yourself, like you don't have an essay that has it in stock or whatever, you can contact Lauren and she will be able to find it for you for her shopping fee. And she is like a Chanel jacket connoisseur. So she finds crazy great Chanel jackets and will resell them as well whenever she gets stock in. So that's kind of the rundown on Curator Lab. So if you haven't followed her already, guys, now is the time. Do yourself a favor. Who is ready to see what I got? I don't even understand how Monica found me a camellia because they're so hard to come by right now. She said that she could only find a shoebox, which is honestly like how this is perfect. Like I couldn't even ask for anything better. I don't know how she found me ribbon and camellia. Like Monica, you are a legend of all legends. If you guys don't know and you're new here, I collect the camellias and I'll show you where I collect them after this actually. And I collect the, oh, you probably can't see it here, but I collect the ribbon in my little ribbon jar. So if I get something from the boutique and I don't get a camellia, I actually get really sad because I have my whole camellia collection and so the fact that she found like one in some like random drawer and and nabbed it for me is the actual best and I'm forever grateful let's open it up ah! here we go oh, I love this gorgeous ribbon in the box and we have <laughs> the Chanel infamous hat black in like a neoprene and or it's probably not it's probably more like a I wonder what 
what it is. Like a nylon maybe. 100%. Oh, it's 100% cotton. Oh, that's good to know. I wear baseball hats literally every day of my life. People wear like leggings and I don't know, sneakers. I wear baseball hats and like black pants. <laughs> like that's what I wear for my casual. So when I saw this, I knew, I just knew that this was going to be the thing that I wear every day. It's ridiculously expensive and was like a stretch, but this is one of those rare items that I know that I'm going to get my cost per wear out of. Usually I'm all about the investment, regardless if I'm going to resell it or not. I only buy something that I'll be able to sell for at least the same exact I bought it for, if not more, five years later after I've already worn it, right? Like that's the rule with luxury and investment buying. But this, I knew without a shadow of a doubt that I would get just every single day wear out of because I have New York Yankees one in all black and I have two of them because I wear them that much. So anyways, I knew it. It was so it was dumb expensive. $600, crazy, absolutely insane for a baseball hat. Like I said, I'm going to wear it every day though. <laughs> like literally every day. So let's try it on. I hope it fits like a glove. Like, oh my gosh, please fit really well. Let's try it on. Let's try it on. Okay. I haven't seen it yet. I want to do like fresh reaction with you. Oh my actual god. Are you kidding me? Actually, how good is it though? Like that fits like a dream. I love it so much more than I thought I was going to love it. Like I, I knew I was going to be like, oh, that's a good one. But like, I'm never taking it off. Definitely. Absolutely. Especially for the price. Never ever. I'm going to shower in it at this point. I'm obsessed. But literally, actually, I don't think there is a more me outfit ever. This is my vibe. This is what I wear every day for like casual, whatever, run around. Like I wear loafers, a oversized jacket and a hat. And then when I'm my normal weight, I wear like a bomb on blazer or something like this. <laughs> this is me. I'm obsessed. Like best purchase ever. Lauren, I owe you the name of my first child. I think that's really like the point that we're getting at here. Like that's the level of what I owe you. <laughs> I love it. Also, I just need to address something really quick. That does not look that bad in real life. I do not understand why it looks 117 shades darker on camera. Every time I stand here and I film like shoes, that's all I see. And it's so irritating. It was a candle, I think, that like spilled. You can't even hardly see it in real life. And then on camera, you not only can see it here, but you can see it through the mirror. Oh my God. Just in case it bothers you just as much as me, like send help. I, I don't know what to do. I'm literally about to burn the carpet. That's like the only solution. Oh. Okay. Okay, and as for the camellia ritual, we have the camellia mannequin right here. And ever since I started collecting Chanel, I put the camellia on the mannequin. So one day the whole thing will be filled. Even all of the pink will just like cover up and the whole thing will just be like a gorgeous little camellia. So this is the next one on our way to fill it up. Yay! And of course we have the Chanel ribbon that goes in the Chanel ribbon jar. And we just kind of pop it in there every time I get a Chanel ribbon. And it makes it kind of fun. Love it. Thank you all so much for watching. If you liked it, please like this video, subscribe, and click the bell so you're notified because I upload new unboxing videos every single day.